Bean, you're amazing. <laughs> of course we needed somewhere to put the pet garden. Piper, what is happening? It's the pet garden. Innovative thinking, fabulous. I have wondered where you were going to put one. Now remember, opening day is in a week. You'd best hurry up. The cafe hardly looks ready yet, and that's just rubble. The VIP customers have already booked in for the grand opening. It would be a disaster if it didn't happen. Don't worry, I have a plan. Sean, what happened? There's a gaping hole in my cafe and the salon is wrecked. I, I don't know. It, it looked solid enough. Although, now looking closer, I think it was a false wall. Why didn't you notice it beforehand? Aren't you a handyman? I mean, I don't usually do full structural inspection before hanging up a photo. It's okay. Uh, we'll make it work. Help me clear out the rubble and put it in the pet garden. Uh, let me call in some friends and we'll have this done in no time. Your friends are really nice. Thanks for calling them. But now we need to make this look like a garden. Any ideas for that? Wow, what a change! What do you think, Bean? I may be a stuntman now, but I still know my way around a building. Whatever you say, Sean. It's not like you just accidentally knocked a wall and the building next door down. But I'm glad you're here to help, famous stuntman or not. <laughs> Thanks, Piper. I think. But we're still missing a critical component. Unless you're planning the whole cafe to be al fresco. Don't worry, I know what to do. Well, speaking of being a famous stuntman, I'd better get back to the lot so they can fire me. Er, uh, set me on fire. This garden is super cute. I can't believe the wall just fell in like that. Um, Piper? Yeah? I, I have a confession. Huh? Yeah, I... I'm the one who told the inspector you were doing illegal work and pulled the banner down. I'm so sorry. I was so angry. Please don't be angry. Were you behind the wall collapse too? No! That wasn't me, I swear! I don't know how that happened. Um, help me put up this garden screen while I think about this. Um... Piper? Are you still mad? Yes. Give me some space while I think about this. I'm really sorry. I thought you were working for a mega coffee chain or something, and... And it was Papa's restaurant, and... Nina, give me space.
she's young. But she's not a child. She should know better, Bean. I mean, I guess we all make mistakes. And she was really emotional about her family losing the business. You're right. I should just forgive her. I think she's learned her lesson. <laughs> right. I'll do the fencing, and then I'll give her her pardon. Uh, Nina, can you come here? Yeah. Listen, what you did was wrong. But you know that, and I understand why. I'm so sorry. I just... Just promise me no more of this passive-aggressive stuff, all right? I promise I'll never do anything like that again. Ah, oh, good. I'm glad we've worked that out. Thank you too, Bean. Okay, next on the list is the quiet room. The calf, but I remember how Papa did it, and I can do it too. This is all a bit much. Nina's confession, the false wall, the inspector out to get me, and all these confusing feelings about Sean. I just wanted to open a cafe we, and other people and pets, could hang out together in. And then there's that letter too. I'll have to remember to give it to Nina later. It's family business, not mine. Bean, with all that's happening, I'm glad I've got you by my side. Okay, let's do this. Great! I think we're going to pull this off, Bean. Hello? salon go I mean it's awesome but whoa it was not exactly planned well I have those old broken radios for you I hope you still have a plan for them I'm hoping to work with a local pet shelter to keep some cats here for adoption I thought they'd make a great cat condo awesome I love creative ideas like that can I help thank you Hi, 
back from my classes. Wow, Piper! That's amazing! Hey, Nina. I heard you're working here now. Yes, I am. I'm sorry I called you a traitor before. It's cool. I get it. Maybe we could hang out more? What about your job at the vintage store? Not quite what I meant. Oh, young love. Oh, phew. Sean's on his way to help with the kitchen. The amount of change in this place is crazy, Piper. I'm really proud of you. Oh, now that you need my approval. Don't forget I've had some help along the way. I'll always be here to help, Piper. So, uh, we need a new serving counter, fridge, pastry cases, and a place for the espresso machine. Pick your design and I'll put it together for you. We'll help. <laughs> hmm. Now for a fridge. This one looks ancient. There you are, a place to lean on and listen to all the problems of Stony Point. Wow, he's really close. It isn't a bar, it's a pet cafe. But I hope you'll be here often. Leaning over. Now we're really close. Oh, mission abort, abort! Uh, the, the counter, leaning over the counter. I plan to be here every morning for my latte. Leaning, uh... Bean! <laughs> you clown! Wow, I'm really bad at this. No wonder we never dated. I can't wait to learn how to use that. I volunteer to try your drinks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, we'll need dog treats and a pastry case. We can't have coffee without cakes. There we are! Easy access to dog treats. 
What about human treats? What kind of treats would you like? Uh, well, um, maybe to, to um, uh. What? We're doing catering from a nearby bakery. Why are you choking, Sean? Hey, um, Piper? What is it? I have this big publicity event for the movie the day after tomorrow. Um, do you think you could come? I'd love to have a friendly face in the crowd. Uh, I'm a bit um, intimidated. Wow, what an amazing opportunity. Yeah, I don't want to blow. Of course we'll come to support you. Listen, we open in three days. The cafe has been on your books for months. We need those pastries for the grand opening. Yes, I'll hold. I guess I'll go myself. Great. Oh, you poor thing. Where are your owners? Bean, is there anyone around? Okay, let's get you inside and cleaned up then. You would not believe how much I had to yell to... Who's that? I found her outside, abandoned. Her collar says Bubbles. She looks too pampered to be purposely abandoned. Well, I'll go outside and talk to people. Don't worry. We'll find your owners. <laughs> It's weird. The shelter said they couldn't find a microchip in her. A cat like her would definitely be chipped. I've put up flyers in the neighborhood. Let's do more work and see if anyone contacts us. Bubbles can stay here until then. <sighs> Thank you, Piper. How about the new hostess stand? Uh, with a spot for Bean, of course. That's a great seat. Uh, did you get it from a used store? I did. There's a lot of great stuff there. Like Ryu? Hmm. We're missing a divider.
Hey, Nina. I found something in the office I think you should have. I didn't want to open it. I thought it might be Nino's. Oh, oh, I knew there'd been a scandal. A scandal? I, I mean, you don't have to tell me. It's fine. It was a long time ago and Papa is gone now. It's to my Nana saying that his relationship with Valerie wasn't what she had always thought. But he couldn't explain it until... Hmm, I don't really get this part, to be honest. Until our song plays again. But Nana died before Papa, so I doubt she ever saw it. I wonder if he ever told her. wonder if you'll ever find out the truth. I'd like to find out, just to know. We haven't heard anything about Bubbles' owners. I guess she'll stay here with us for now. Don't worry, Bubbles. We'll look after you. I think she likes you. Right, so it's time to get this supply room into shape. Possums in the supply room? Well, it's not the weirdest thing to happen lately. I'll call you the posse. Hello? Anyone here? Miss Wilson? What happened to the building next door? Of course he'd make a surprise visit now. If he finds wild animals in the cafe, we'll all be in trouble. Bean? like everything is normal. Arr! Inspector Miller, hello. How can I... Miss Wilson, are you okay? Where's the stopcock? Oh, the what? Oh my god, there's water everywhere. It's probably in the supply room. Let me through. I can't let him find the posse. Don't go in. Uh, I mean, uh, I can do it. Uh, tell me what it looks like. Code violation. What did I do? I'll think of something. It won't be hard. At least he didn't find the posse. What am I going to do with them? Let them live here? Well, first things first. Whew, that took forever. But I think we're done now. I sure hope the posse is happy. Oh my goodness, Bean! I forgot about Sean's big event! Huh? Sean, you're here. Yeah, like I promised. 
I am so sorry. There was a catastrophe at the cafe, and the inspector was here, and by the time it was all done, I just... I wish you would have at least called. I should have. I'm sorry. Hey guys, I'm here! Wow, it's a bit tense in here. Let's just do this. Getting the cafe done is obviously Piper's biggest priority. Why wouldn't it be? It's her dream, isn't it? But I'm not the only one with dreams. Well, I'll find a way to make it up to him. Papa and Nana would be proud. Wow! What a makeover! My work here is done. Thank you, Sean. I'll call Della and tell her we can open as planned. Thank you. 